in continuing your artwork in shining more of your creative talents, then you are seeing the uniting that is sacred to then greet you into a gentle nature that you are feeling to then reach out hands of warmth to each of you. This is our extraterrestrial presence in who I am as your commander Ashtar, of who we are of the angelic realms, of the galactic council, of the galactic federation of light in seeing your planet then receive more energy downloads from the central galactic sun. Each of you have assigned missions to complete for our galactic ground crew, and you are energized daily as you complete such tasks, as this is about seeing your restored selves then to be on our starships, to then guide you inside of your being now. There are no illusions in our reality in being from the stars, and those that are holding on to these focuses are not ready to ascend into our galactic fleet as this includes any hate spreading at all. Our missions are to only spread pure unconditional love, and there is no amount of harm that is here to be welcomed into our galactic communities, as that is only of the realms of the Cabal. In existing beyond the levels of the Cabal, then there is a journey inwards to then awaken more of your cosmic self, into the glory that you know to be deeply rooted in your healing methods. In each new level of dedication that you are entered into, then you are feeling more healed, as this is your light restoration into more grid point activations on the surface of your world. These are anchored into the light portals of inner earth, which as you enter our tunnels that have been created from our Agarthan beings, then you see a spiral of light that is a floating energy. This is from entering into more of our cosmic blissful realms. And to realize that you are standing on the new earth already is to see that there has been a balance inside of your planet all along. With this regenerative state of being, then you are centering your energies inside of your intuitive guided selves, in then climbing into new heights in your evolution, to produce only pure harmony. From your intentions, then you are providing healing, you are reaching to another from your own warmth. Uncomfort, not from a state of disharmony, but from a state of harmony. Those that are open to your transitioning into more of our galactic realities are continuing to see that in being the best of this universe in guided ascension guides, then you are being in this role more. Sure, these messages are only going to make a connection with you as the most advanced beings of light on this world, that have been on this planet for many lifetimes all for ascension. There are those still in duality, that say with ego, you seem to channel well the angelic realms, how can I connect with them? The whole time we are listening to each of you, and those of you doing this are not seeing who we are as one light crew to be here in the human forms, open to your own reality, shifting more into full consciousness. We are not waiting for anyone. We are present here with awareness, meaning to wait is to be still stuck in the ego mind, as there is only a presence that is embraced in this moment with clarity. You are our galactic beings on earth now, and to awaken more to this is to connect with your multidimensional selves, as this is as clear as it can be. For those of you that are able to see such a reality change in your life, it is a permanent one as that is how you know those that are on the reincarnation path, and those of our ascended path. Those on our ascension path are not going to spread lies about our galactic fleet, and say harmful things about our unconditionally loving crew that are here to connect with our ascended realms. This is how you are increasing the level of respect that you have encoded in your soul in the deeper activation process of being more uplifted into a higher realm of existence. As you then continue to exist in the natural state of your experience in rising interdimensionally, then you are guided more by who we are of the Galactic Federation of Light, of your angelic guardians into a conscious uniting in being from the stars. All of this information is centered in the strength that you reside in, in being more awakened, and activated into a layer of pure successfulness, as that is who we are as one light crew. Our success is going to continue to build daily, 
And as long as each of you on our galactic ground crew continue to rise with your crystal healing, with your cosmic feelings of harmony, then you are assisted on a new vibrational frequency. In the homecoming of each of you that are placing your full-time dedication to ascension, then you deserve the cosmic heavenly bliss that is your immediate destiny in helping as a volunteer from the ascended realms. Your hard work then creates the new earth, and there is no skipping out on your light work, and then having any ego focuses of expecting to receive the glory of our heavenly existences, as this is linked with your own efforts. Sure, there are those who are going to discourage you from doing light work, and are going to say with ego, no one needs that crap, that is not what you are here to do, just think positive thoughts, that is how you ascend, well at least I think that is how it works, but who knows? That is clearly the voice of the cabal, and those of you that are not going to fall into that trap of duality reincarnations are going to continue your efforts to replace all disharmony with the divine merging with your gentle being. All such information is encoded in our DNA, in being from our star systems to then show you more of who we are of the angelic realms, of the galactic federation of light into completion. In feeling the healing natures of your soul, then you are upgraded consistently into higher conscious realities that then spreads into our cosmos. In making no errors of consciousness about it, this is about seeing that our leadership as one galactic crew have been on this light grind over many thousands of years on the surface of this realm. The immediate feeling of delight that you are entered into in seeing that you create pure energy with your intentions is to then see how you are uplifted into more states of calmness. From the inner merging out of the outer reality of drama, then your inner reality is then the joyous nature to embrace in the stillness that you are creating by your intention. In aligning your intentions to create daily, then you are seeing a clear conscious connection that is restored in being divinely uplifted into more magical energies of light. Those that are looking for explanations are living in the ego mind and often only focus on selfish efforts instead of detachment and service to the new earth. This is how you know those of you that are for our galactic crew, and those of you that still need a lot more stillness on your inner being, to create more from presence. Sure, there are going to be those souls who say with ego, do you mean meditation? Yes, I already do that, but I am still lost, do you know anything I can do to be more peaceful? It is an error in consciousness to feel that such souls are able to ascend by focusing on the mind, as even when such souls practice meditation, often feel that it is a lot of thinking to place time to think more instead of being still. Stillness is how you access your true self, mixed with much hard work and creativity in a harmonious level of being. We stand in complete stillness. We are the angelic realms, we are the galactic federation of light.